rough. Hello you guys, happy honeymoon vlog. We have made it to Brighton. It has been such a travel day, which is why I look this way. But I just wanted to quickly start the vlog and give you a little tour of our cute little flat. Okay, so you walk into the door. We have like just a cute little mirror here. And then this is our sweet little bathroom. A nice toilet, sink, shower bathtub situation. Very cute, very quaint. And then you walk in, and this is kind of like our living space. Look at this cute little nook. Oh, and then here just pulls down our bed, which is so nice. And then through this little door is our cute kitchen. And he got us cute little croissants. It's so sweet. Um, yeah, so, so cute. It has a nice washer. All of, all of the things we'll need. Are you ready to head out to Brighton? Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. We heard lots about a food festival, which I have seen. Is it a YouTube. French festival? No, French it's just food? food from all over the world. Oh, so if you misheard, yeah. It's I don't a, understand. Yeah, it's just a food festival, but we're right by the seaside. We are refreshed, popped on some new makeup, put my hair back because it's very windy. It's actually really chilly today, um, but we are going to go down to the seaside. I'm so excited. We're going to find somewhere to eat. We have a couple spots that I really want to hit. Why are you praying like that? Look at that handsome boy. You look so good. We're ready. <laughs> I'm ready to find Zoe. I just did a bit of makeup just in case I run into her. Like, oh my god, hi! Let's grab a picture! Why are you doing, why are you doing that face? Mm. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah, we found, we're gonna take him Let's to do a nice dessert place. And what's this guy doing? I'm kinda hungry. I didn't invite him. I know, but you let's go grab dinner. Look at our grand staircase. Dun 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 dun. I honestly really like your socks like that, but You do? Yeah, Thank you. Um, I'm actually very proud of myself. I am not jet lagged at all. I'm not tired. I didn't sleep anything on the plane. Why are you laughing? <laughs> because it's been like two hours. But isn't it serious. supposed to hit me? I don't know. I'm feeling fresh. I'm feeling awake, alive, excited. No, I'm glad you're feeling this way, well. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at where you're walking. Look at the sun's come out a little bit. Oh, look at Brighton, I swear. No. I love it so much. Oh, I almost fell again. Oh, bye, take it there. It's like they know we're in love. It's like they know it's our wedding. <laughs> Oh, I should have got a wind muff. Oh my god, look at that We just cone. found the foodie festival. And they gave us free tickets. Everyone here is so nice. Really? Everyone is nice. So nice. So we're gonna grab a quick treat before we do dinner. And then and then we'll make our way to dinner. We as it is. Are you kidding me or not? And they gave us free macaroon things for our honeymoon. They're so nice. Oh, I just found the waffle. Sebastian has all the food. I'm so yeah. Trying to 
find some coffee or something to warm us up. But... There's oh, there's Pratt? There. Okay, let's go to Pratt. But like everything's closed and it's like five o'clock. So we're gonna, yeah, I wanna go into Pratt. <laughs> and a lash. Oh, that would be nice to get like a bubble bath. That's cute. Take me to the coffee shop. Mmm, Maybank holiday. passed out last night and it was so funny because I didn't vlog after I can't really remember I think we went on the tour and then we went home after that and we were drinking wine and we passed out and Sebastian woke up because he spilled the wine all over our bed um, well only his size I was nice and warm and cozy but we we're up this morning to go find breakfast we're gonna go to this really nice restaurant well it's not really nice but I just heard lots of good things about it so we're really excited Sebastian has a bit of a tummy issue like explosive diarrhea. Yeah, which it's is not just so like a, weird because we've been bad. eating the same thing. We we're not yeah. really sure. So we're gonna go find some medicine. Hopefully make him feel better. Oh <laughs> whoops. We got our anti-diarrhea and we're trekking on. Let's go find breakfast, my sweet boy. <laughs> Look at your face! Ice, that was. Oh, that was cute. That was cute. That was cute. <laughs> oh my god, we both look at each other right there. Look at this mac and cheese. That's gonna be good. That's gonna be so good. <laughs> we just had a whole bottle of wine. <laughs> and we're feeling good. And we, we are, had a really good talk. We had a really good that talk was such a about fun time. our children and our future home. In our house. In our house. That's the same thing. And now we're gonna head to Dum Dum Donuts to get a good donuts. And then lunch. And then wine, and then we're on our way home. We'll check in with you at Dum Dum's. Follow me, guys. <laughs> I think my favorite part of Brighton is like the little lanes like this. Yeah. It's so cute. Yeah. Yeah. Everything's already closed. It's crazy. Oh, here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, my God, is it cold? <laughs> oh, I will be so bad. Look at the cronut. That's what we're gonna get, a krona. It's like a donut and a croissant. Dang. Everyone, when you're in Brighton, oh, I, you guys, oh, all I've been talking about this whole trip is Dum Dum Donuts. I thought you looked it up and they said seven. Oh no. Oh no. 
It's until they sell out. Oh. Mm. But we can get the store. Huh? Oh. I'm so I'm mad. I'm sorry, baby. We'll come get it tomorrow. I promise. Promise? Promise, yeah. Hello, everyone. We are back home, and we just got back from running around town. We went to the grocery store, which I was so excited about. My phone died, so as it's charging, I thought that I... Uh, we'll just do a quick little haul of what we got. We went into Primark, which I know I talk about thrifting all the time and not fast fashion and yada, yada, yada. And I'm trying to be better, but he stopped into Primark and I thought I would just show a couple things that I got because... As you know, I love thrifting. Better for the environment, better for the world, but it's not like my only way of shopping. I still shop at these local places, so I thought that I would just show you anyway. Um, so I picked up these cute white sandals. I thought that they were just super cute and easy for spring. Um, I picked up this gorgeous, oh, I don't know why they gave me the hanger. I don't need that. Um, this gorgeous like mint green and white little sundress that has the buttons going all the way down. I thought this would be cute for work with like a uh, white undershirt underneath it and those sandals. I thought it was really cute for spring. And then I also got, oh my gosh, Sebastian got so many clothes, it's crazy. Then I got these super, super cute little snakeskin toe cap little slide-ons. I don't know. They're really cute. And then I got some earrings. Oh, they're right here, which are to die. They're like a woven hoop with a nice little tortoiseshell little thing. So that's what we picked up for Primark. Again, it's no different than like my Forever 21 hauls. I'm trying to be better. Me and Sebastian had a little conversation in the line. Um, I'm conscious of it, but yeah, that's just what we picked up. And then we went into Tesco's and it was the best time ever. I have wanted to go to a grocery store for so long. So for a little snack, we picked up some Tostitos lime chips because we just thought it'd be good to snack on. Um, then we picked up a bottle of sparkling wine. Very excited. It is our last night here, so we wanted to celebrate. Where are the rest of my goodies? Hello. And then I picked up Tea Pig's Peppermint Tea. And so we always drink this brand. So I thought I would pick some up and take some home with me because I did want to bring a like bag of tea to work um, to have there. So I thought I would try the peppermint because I really like peppermint tea. Then we picked up Again, all of my YouTubers talk about these naked bars. So we picked up the um, coconut, oh no, no. The chocolate crunch is what we picked up. Very excited. Sebastian picked up a Kinder bar. And then, what else? I picked up a Kit Kat crunchy. Delicious. Oh, we have some mild salsa. And then we also picked up eggs for breakfast in the morning. I think that's it. Oh, and then we have our much needed adapter because we didn't pick one up before we left. Oh, and Sebastian got a Kinder Egg. I think that's everything. Yeah, so that is everything. We are just going to chill now. Sebastian's going to shower. I'm going to shower. We had such a good last day here in Brighton. I was so sad to leave. Everyone has truly been so nice to us and so kind and welcoming. And every time we say we're on our honeymoon, they're so excited for us and like congratulate us. It's been really good. Um, but we're also excited just to head to Italy now and just explore a new place and we are leaving at like 11.30, so we are going to Dum Dums tomorrow morning. I know Sebastian promised on the vlog, so we're going to go that, do that tomorrow. Um, and yeah, I haven't been tired. I haven't felt jet lag at all. I think it's just because I've been so excited here, and I feel so like at home, and I just love it. So hopefully I have that same excitement for Italy. I know I will. The food is going to be great. Um, the food here has been nice. We had one 
like gross dinner last night it like was not good at all but i think that could have just been where we were we had dinner tonight and it was so delicious breakfast was good so um the food has been good but i think italy the food will be like amazing because that's my favorite kind of food is italian food so i'm very excited and of course we'll keep you guys up on the vlog but i think i will end this vlog tomorrow um and that will be the London vlog, or no, the Brighton vlog. It'll be, it'll be over tomorrow. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. And I don't think I'm gonna film anything else tomorrow. I mean, today, I literally, we got a free bottle of wine at dinner, so just kidding. Oh, we also got these glasses at Primark. Are they so cute? They're like a tortoiseshell. Very cute. Um, I think that's all I'm gonna film tonight. If not, you'll see the next clip here but if not I'll see you guys tomorrow morning good morning everyone it is Wednesday morning and we are packing up because we head to Rome today so that is the end of Brighton and I'm so so sad to leave but I also feel like this was such a decent amount of time it's not like a huge popping city um so I feel like I did everything that I wanted to do I saw everything I wanted to do lastly we're gonna go um, to Dum Dums because as you guys saw last night they were closed <laughs> so we're gonna go to Dum Dums and then head to the airport um, but yeah I feel so grateful that I was able to be here and Sebastian gave me the time to explore the city on our honeymoon because he's never been before but it's not like he's heard of it and um, he loved it like he loved it so much everyone was so nice to us everyone that we talked to every single one of our uber drivers the people at the restaurants like people in town like everyone was just so kind to us i'm gonna put you down um so i feel like that made it that much better um that everyone was so kind so we are ready to go to italy though i'm so ready for the food i think i'm gonna love it like even when I was here, I wanted to eat like pizza and pasta and I've been saving it so I can eat it there. So I'm very excited. I feel like all I am is just starving because I just want Italian food. But um, what was I going to say? I woke up in the middle of the night. That's the thing is I haven't had a single like shred of jet lag. Um, so I think it's been good. I don't know. We'll see how I feel in Italy, but I feel so good. I go to bed at like the right time here, which is nice. Um, but I woke up at like three in the morning because I had the worst dream last night. It was so scary. And so ugh, I feel like that threw me off. But other than that, <sighs> Sebastian, get out of the shower. He takes the longest showers. Let's see what this boy is doing. It's such a rainy day too. Sebastian, what? it's time to get out of the shower. Where is it? To get out of the shower. Where is it? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll cut it out. <laughs> what time is it? It is 10.36. It's 10.36, let's go. Huh? 10.36. Oh, okay. Let's go, no. We have like 10 minutes Okay, why are you watching TV in the shower? <laughs> we are never ever ever gonna leave. Yeah, I will, I'll show it Dum Dums because I'm so excited for Dum Dums. Um, but what I was saying is yeah, it's such a gloomy day for our last little morning in England. But we do, um, look how pretty, I love this view. I think it's so pretty from our like window bedroom. Um, or a bedroom window. <laughs> I We end our honeymoon in London, so I will still be back in the UK. I'm very excited now to see London since I kind of eased my way into the city uh, or the country, I guess, with like Brighton. Like it's such a smaller, quieter town. Lots of people go here to retire and stuff like that. So I'm excited to see London and like go to a bar and like, you know, have a lot of nightlife. Um, and so I'm excited to go back. It's a grown nut. We will shortly be arriving at Preston Park. Oh, the train's in the way. Hi. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome on board this way, going to around the machine up to another living chair pod. Okay, so, please, 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 please